I promise we'll look after Scales. We'll make sure that she's safe and that she doesn't hurt anyone. Now, I need your help. You saw for yourself. Vampire abominations prowl the springs. Those are my father's toys. Sick creations of his evil mind. We've all been infected. Cursed. Plagued. Call it what you will. We're vampires. But we don't have to succumb to the curse's savage nature. My father thinks otherwise. He believes we should embrace the bloodlust, the power, taking those who can't oppose us and making them our own. A civil war rages through East March. He feels the time is right to strike. He wants to grow an army of undead before anyone notices. My father must be stopped at all costs. He's already targeted the Winterland Hunters. He's about to turn them into his puppets. Joruk downstairs can tell you how to save them. That's our first step. This world is a deadly place when the sun glows bright in the sky. It's just too dangerous outside. Even the wounds I recently suffered require time and a great deal of blood to overcome. Imagine the cost of trying to deal with all those hunters. I must say you are a strange one. Others would have drawn weapons the moment they saw what I was. Anyway, I could attempt to scare them away, but they're hunters. I don't suspect they scare very easily. We turn my father into dust, and end this tyranny once and for all. The hunters are merely a distraction. If we deny him their blood, he'll grow curious, perhaps even vulnerable. He'll want to know who interfered with his plans. I hope Valeric didn't convince you to join our cause. Our battles never end well. True, his father's a bastard, but he's a strong bastard. Valeric can't beat him and those who help us usually die. But enough depressing talk. How can Jeruk help you? Ah yes, many times. Each time, things have gone horribly wrong. It usually ends up very messy, lots of blood, but don't worry about it. Everything will be different this time. Yes, yes, Jaruk always has a plan. The blood fiends hunt by scent. They have the hunter's scent and await the command to strike. If we mask the scent, the blood fiends will lose interest and wander off. The Hunters will be saved. Take this liquid. It is a gift from Jaruk's close friends, Cello and Harp. Don't ask what it is you don't want to know. Splash it on the Hunters. Make them smell like something the Blood Fiends won't want to eat. Oh, they'll hate it. They'll probably try to kill you. It's best if you rough them up a bit first. Show them who's stronger. Then splash it in their faces. As long as they end up very smelly, the hunters should be safe. Majorn, my master, would like to speak with you. You've made contact with Majorn's son, Valeric. He's a troubled young man, ashamed of his heritage. Majorn simply wishes to end the conflict with his son. For this reason, my lord requests to meet with you. Oh, it's not just you. Others have tried to help Valeric. They either see how futile their task is, or they fail. My master wants to explain this to you. You don't have to make any decisions right now. Just hear him out. He will meet with you in his manor, the one to my left. No harm will come to you at this time. Majorn gives you his word.
Piss on people. You saved the lives of the hunters. You ruined their clothes, but you saved their lives. My father will be upset when his slaves fail to locate new prey. He'll become curious. Then we'll catch him off guard. My father won't risk going outside. It's too dangerous. The sun is deadly to his ancient form. No, he'll send his thrall Tunis to see what went wrong. We need to catch my father before he returns to the crypts and locks the doors behind him. Rala will sneak into my father's manor and wait for Tunis to return. She'll deal with him. I need you to enter the crypts. Rala may be a vampire, but she's still young. She wouldn't stand a chance against an ancient. Rala is quick. She can blend with the shadows. Slitting a thrall's throat is well within her capabilities. But someone more powerful than her needs to confront my father. leave me alone. I don't want to talk about what happened here. I couldn't resist the urge. I had to feed. Valeric keeps us locked away. He doesn't let us feed. Not naturally. Not like this. I need blood to survive. Why deny me this pleasure? I don't care what Valeric taught us. This is who we are. This is what we are. If we ever hope to defeat the Ancients, we must embrace the power as they do. We can't keep feeding on skeevers and hope to grow strong. We must. We must feast. It's been so long. You just don't understand. How could you? I need this to live. Valeric starves us. We mostly feed on animals, finding criminals when we can. There's a reason we're not as strong as the Ancients. We must grow stronger. No, uh, I... You're right. What am I doing? I've fallen just as the ancients wanted us to. Here, this is the key to the crypts. Tunis had it. Go in there and end this, please.
gone. I can feel it. His presence faded when you struck him down. We don't need to fear his tyranny any longer. You killed Mayor, not me. Don't take this the wrong way. We're grateful for what you have done, but you did it. 
You destroyed a tyrant who could have built a formidable force, one strong enough to challenge the Scald King. Now, that won't happen. We will go somewhere safe, a place where we won't be a danger to others. My friends still have much to learn. I can't risk others until I know they can control their temptations. No one will fall victim to our people again.